What's going on everyone? Welcome to the first video of our new channel, Hunt the Heartland. Right now what we're gonna do today is hunt um, this new piece of land that we got access to. We got access to this land towards the end of last year. Um, came out here, had some good encounters with does. Uh, not really any bucks, but there's definitely tons of does around here and it's a great spot to just come and get the freezer filled. It's a uh, it's interesting it's sort there's a bunch of houses it's kind of like an urban spot there's a lot of houses set up all around it and then in the central um there's just tons of bedding area and it's really marshy and stuff but then on the outskirts of that and then like in everyone's yards is tons of white oaks and all sorts of other plants and acorns and everything that deer love to eat set up in my permanent stand. What I did is uh, I converted an old ladder stand and then I basically use it as a permanent saddle hunting platform. That way I can hide behind the tree when these deer are walking right through this trail. I already saw deer moving this morning so we'll see what we see.
much more does come through. Probably at least eight of them. <laughs> they might have made their way over here, but the homeowner came in and I don't know, her muffler is really loud or something and it spooked them. So that sucks, but that's the problem with hunting such a small property. Goofy little things like that happen. That's okay. Um, we still got lots of daylight. Well, no, no. We still got some light left, so we'll uh, kind of see if anything makes its way back over here before it gets too dark. I'm up in a tree right now. Back on uh, my private land spot. I wasn't going to hunt tonight. Um, but I ended up doing it anyway, so <clears throat> I don't have much of a of a shooting lane right now. But I do have a good spot if they come through. And it's where I shot my doe through last year, so I guess we'll see um, if anything comes this way. Otherwise, I'm more just kind of observing and kind of seeing how they're moving through here in the evening. stand in this small little area it would have been perfect but either way it was hard to take a clean shot at her anyway and she was kind of small but she ended up spooking when those car I don't know if you can hear it but those uh the car doors were slamming and it spooked her and and then she saw a little bit of movement in the tree and then she looked up at me and that was enough for her to take off so oh well Kinda, she was kind of young anyways. I want to go for the bigger ones that are in here.
All right, guys. Well, that's a wrap for this video. Um, didn't get a dough yet. Still going to work on it. I got lots of time left in the season. Um, but the with all the content I got, it's going to be getting kind of long here. So that, that buck came out, that small buck came out, as you saw, and started chasing those does and pushing them around. I was hoping one of those bigger does would come my way, but it didn't happen. Uh, they ended up spooking and running off the other direction so uh the rut is beginning so we got a lot of cool content coming up with that and i know the other guys on the team are hard at work filming right now and uh we're gonna be working hard to bring you content through the rest of the season and then we've got a whole plan for next year too so uh make sure if you haven't make sure you like comment subscribe and it really helps us out with the algorithm and everything and um just help grow our channel we may not always shoot deer but we just really like documenting the journey and getting out there and just having fun bow hunting so uh thanks again for watching and we'll catch you guys in the next video